This is Kiki, and here are my keys to tonight's Chicago Blackhawks game against the New York Rangers. And my first key is start the game off on a good note. In Monday night's game against the Toronto Maple Leafs, the Blackhawks did a great job of starting off the game on a good note. The last time that the Blackhawks and the Rangers played against each other back in October, their game didn't start off well. Tonight, in order to avoid a repeat of the last meeting, the Blackhawks need to try to start off the game on a good note by being active and visible, have some energy, and stay on their A game. My second key is keep capitalizing on your power play. In Monday night's game, the Blackhawks did a great job with the power play, scoring four power play goals. And currently, their power play is six in the league. In order for them to keep up the good work, they need to continue to capitalize on their power play opportunities when it comes along. And my last key is be aware of the Rangers. The New York Rangers will be coming off a 3-1 to win against the Philadelphia Flyers. According to the Blackhawks game preview, the Rangers averaged 2.86 goals per game, and the Blackhawks puck management needs improvement. I agree with that, and also the Blackhawks need to continue to get more pucks to the net, and when they have the puck, they need to try to shoot it. Here are some key Rangers players to be aware of. Matt Zuccarello, who currently leads the team in points. Derek Brizard, who currently leads the team in goals. Keith Yandel, who currently leads the team in assists. And Derek Stepan, who has gotten three goals and two assists in his last five games. That's all for Kiki's Keys to the Game. I will give you the game recap after. Until then, go Blackhawks. Enjoy the game tonight.